Welcome back to the Tree of Life Crochet Along. In this video, we'll be doing row 38, and we'll be doing the first repeat only, and I do the entire row with you in video part 28. This is the second time we'll be doing the trees graph, row 38, and here are all the instructions. They're the same as before, and there are 27 steps if you'd like to pause it and take a screenshot or copy them down. Okay, and let me show you what it looks like. Row 38 will be on the back of the work. Okay like that. Okay, let me zoom in and we'll get started. And the first thing that we need to do for this row is put in five single crochets. I already have my first one. My first single crochet in. Okay, so that's one. Two, three, four, five single crochets, and then we'll need to do one back post double crochet. So yarn over, go in and out through the back around that post, and make a double crochet. Okay, I'm going to mark out my paper here. And now we need to make three single crochets and one back post double crochet. Okay. Go into that very first single crochet right there. One, two, three, and one back post double crochet. Yarn over. Go in and out through the back around that next post and make a double crochet. Okay, and now we are going to do it again. We're going to make three single crochets and then one back post double crochet. Okay, so go into that first single crochet, which is right here. One, two, three single crochets, and then one back post double crochet. We're on that next post, yarn over in and out through the back, double crochet. Okay, and now we are going to make two single crochets and skip one single crochet, and then make one back post double crochet. Okay, go into that very first single crochet. We're going to make two single crochets, one, two, and we're going to skip that last single crochet, and then we're going to make one back post double crochet. Okay, there are two posts right there. We're going to go around this first one, yarn over, and not through the back around that first post, double crochet. Okay, and now we are going to single crochet in top of the post stitch that we just made. Okay, so the one on the hook, follow it down to that V and we're going to put a, it's right there actually, that's the top of the stitch facing us. We're going to put our hook in up under there and make a single crochet. And it's a little stretched out actually from the way the stitches have been made. Okay, and one single crochet. And then in the next stitch, we're going to put a single crochet in the top of that stitch, and that's the top of a post stitch. Now we're going to make one back post double crochet around the post stitch under the single we just made. So yarn over, stretch your work out so you can see that post under that single we just made, and go in and out through the back around that post pull up a loop and make a double crochet. Okay. 
and now we are going to skip one single crochet and make two single crochets. Okay, we're going to skip that very first single crochet, go into the second one, and make two single crochets, one and two, and then we're going to make four back post double crochets. We're at that, the crisscrossing. Okay, we're going to yarn over, and the first ones we're going to pick up, you can flip your work over like that and you can see them clearly. Okay, put your hook up under that first one, that first post, and make a double crochet. There's your first back post double crochet. We're going to make four, and the next one is right beside it. Yarn over, slip your hook in under that stitch. It's a long stitch because it's a treble crochet, and we're going to make a double crochet. And now the next two that we're going to go around are facing in the other direction. Okay, yarn over, and we're going to pull up that stitch. Okay, there's that stitch, and there's the next one. Go around that first one, and make a double crochet. Okay, and then there's one more left. It's easier to go around. Yarn over, go in and out through the back around that post, and make a double crochet. Okay, and there we have our four back post double crochets. And now we're going to make two single crochets and skip one single crochet and then make one back post double crochet. Okay, so skip this very first single crochet, go into the second one and make two single crochets, one, and then in the next stitch, two, and then we're going to make one back post double crochet. Okay, there are two right here, and we're going to first go around this first post, yarn over, go in and out through the back around that post, make a double crochet, and now we're going to make a single crochet in top of the post stitch that we just made. Okay, that post that's on our hook, follow it down to that stitch, put a single crochet under that V, and then in the next post stitch at the very top, we're going to put another single crochet, and now we're going to make a back post double crochet around the post under the single crochet we just made. So yarn over, go in and out through the back around that post, pull up a loop and make a double crochet. Okay. And now we are going to make, we're going to skip one single crochet and make two single crochets. Skip one single crochet, go into the second one. One and two, and now we are going to single crochet in top of the next post stitch. Okay, that very next stitch is a post stitch. Put a single crochet right in the top of it. Be sure to pick up two loops. Okay. And now we're going to make one back post double crochet under the single crochet we just made around that post. So yarn over and stretch your work out go under that single crochet, in and out through the back around that post, pull up a loop, make a double crochet, just like so. And now we are going to skip one single crochet and make two single crochets. Okay, skip the very first one, go into the second one. one, and the next one, two, okay, and next we're going to put a single crochet in top of the next post stitch. That very next stitch is a post stitch. We're going to put a single crochet right there in the top of it, one single crochet. And now we're going to put a back post double crochet under the single crochet we just made. So yarn over, 
and go in and out through the back around that post. Pull up a loop and make a double crochet. And now we are going to skip one single crochet and make two single crochets. Skip that first single crochet, go into the second one. One, next stitch, two single crochets. And now we are going to make one back post double crochet. Okay, around this next post, yarn over. Go in and out through the back around that post and make a double crochet. And now we are going to make five single crochets. Okay, go into that very first single crochet right here. One, two, three, four, and five single crochets. And that is the end of our first repeat. And uh, all you need to do is rewind this video and watch it again to continue on. And I'm just going to check it real quick against my stitch marker. That last stitch I made lines up with the stitch before my stitch marker. And I'm going to finish this row and I will see you in the next video.